Now, Singh Yadav has been banned for four years by CAS following an appeal by WADA against his exoneration. He will not be able to participate in Rio. He was scheduled to start his campaign in the freestyle wrestling later today. Narsingh Yadav will not be able to participate in Rio after all. He has been banned for four years by the Court of Arbitration for Sports following an appeal by WADA against his exoneration. The World Anti-Doping Agency had exercised its right to appeal to CAS after the wrestler was given a clean chit by the National Anti-Doping Panel in New Delhi. Narsingh was supposed to begin his campaign on Friday but this has been brought to a halt. He will now have to vacate the Olympic Village and surrender his accreditation card. एक ऐसा खिलाड़ी जिसने देश के लिए सबसे पहले क्वालिफाई किया आज एक झटके के अंदर उसके भाग्य का फैसला हुआ और बहुत खराब हुआ हम भारत सरकार से आग्रह करेंगे कि इस पूरे प्रकरण की सीबीआई जांच कराए द केस हैज सीन अ लॉट ऑफ ट्विस्ट एंड टर्न्स he had to go through a whole court procedure against 2008 and 2012 medal winner Sushil Kumar to secure his berth in the 74 kilo category. He then tested positive for banned steroids. Nursing claimed that there was foul play and alleged sabotage. While anti-doping panel exonerated him as they found merit in his claims of sabotage. However, in came WADA and appealed against the decision. Narsingh's team was notified about a hearing on the 13th. His lawyers tried all they could, but in the end, Narsingh had to face the red flag. He's out of the Olympics, out of the village and out of competitive wrestling for the next four years. And perhaps this brings a closure to the whole case. Or is there another twist in the tale? With Borya Majumdar in Rio, Sports Bureau, India Today. And Narsingh Yadav has spoken out against the ban, saying to say I am devastated at the decision of CAS would be putting it mildly. My dream of competing and winning a medal for the country has been cruelly snatched away from me 12 hours before my bout. I will do everything to prove my innocence. We are also getting in a reaction from his family. Take a look. So, very sad thing. So, we will do everything that वड़ा ने ऐसे क्यों कर रहे हैं हमारे बेटा को लड़ने दीजिए एक पे करेंगे तो बहुत दुख की बात है हाथ फेरे जाने की नौबत है हमारा बेटा तो अपने से किए ने सब लोग उसमें डाल दिए थे तो अभी तो अपने से किए तो बात ठीक है अरे आप ही हमारे घर पे पानी पिएंगे हम कुछ डाल दिए तो हम गुनगार है कि वो है हमारे बेटा के पीछे पड़ा है हमको कुछ समझ में नहीं आ रहा है कि मेरे बेटा को आज खेलने का मौका आ गया उसी टाइम हमारे बेटा को क्यों रोक लगा ले रहे हैं हम यही प्रधानमंत्री से मनाया करता हूँ प्रणाम करता हूँ कि हमारे बेटा को खेल के टाइम मत सदमा लगाओ हमारे बेटा को एकदम छूट दे दो मेरा बेटा का दिल कैसे क्या करता है हमारे बेटा कैसे लड़ेगा अब हमारा भाई नहीं खेल पाएंगे लेकिन ये जो चार साल का प्रतिबंध है मेरा भाई निर्दोष है इनके साथ शादी से इसे हटा दिया जाए we have uh, Shobit Mittal who is live with us from our newsroom this morning. Uh, Shobit, the family of course claiming innocence, saying this is a case of sabotage. But uh, I want to understand how is it that uh, Narsingh Yadav managed to get a clean chit from NADA but uh, he's been banned by the international body? Absolutely, uh, Simi. But uh, let me before that just mention that uh, when this story broke late last night, all other major networks got it wrong that nursing had been given a clean shit. India Today was the only channel that uh, brought you the inside details from that CAS hearing in Rio and at the end of which nursing Yadav was uh, suspended for four years. Now the big question is that when the Indian anti-doping uh, panel found nursing to be innocent, they, they uh, came to the conclusion that it was a clear case of sabotage as nurse as nursing and the wrestling federation had been maintaining the doping panel agreed to it and thus nursing was allowed to go to rio to represent india now when he landed in rio they should have uh, they should have uh, uh, they should have expected that the, either the World Anti-Doping Agency or some other country would have raised objections and even the Russian contingent had told India today at the, at the Games Village that they have a problem with nursing competing at the Games especially because their athletes has been, had been suspended on doping charges. So 
either the case was that nursing over here in India was uh, given a clean sheet without proper proof or secondly if the anti-doping uh, agency over here in India had enough proof right. then they did not present the case uh, pr properly enough in front of the court uh, of arbitration for sport. Right. Shobit I want to understand what exactly happened at that CAS uh, hearing last evening. Uh, did, did, did Nursing Yadav have uh, his lawyers to represent him? Was he asked to make his own argument? What happened there? Yes, absolutely. Nursing was present and uh, his lawyers uh, from India also joined via video conference. Uh, the IOA had mentioned that they would provide him legal assistance in Rio as well. So the, uh, over there as well, nursing's, uh, uh, you know, the nursing and his supporters put forth his case, presented uh, their case that it was a clear case of sabotage. They had given the evidence in front of the National Anti-Doping Agency as well. So they had to present the same evidence in front of the CAS based on which they had given him the, him the clean chit. However, uh, they did not manage to convinced the CAS, the World Anti-Doping Agency maintained that since uh, banned steroids were found in his bloodstream, there could be no other reason and he has to serve his suspension. The CAS at the end of the hearing said that uh, this decision is final and no other prayers in the case will be entertained anymore. So the case is over as far as nursing is concerned. Uh, as far as CAS, uh, their verdict is concerned, he will have to uh, serve uh, that suspension period. However, for nursing himself, it has been a very rocky ride to the Olympic Games. Uh, not only he had to win a court case against Sushil Kumar. He had to then, uh, there was this entire doping saga where he had to put forth his case and clear his name. He underwent a mental conditioning camp before going to Rio in Mumbai uh, where, uh, where uh, doctors attended to him and ensured that he's in the right frame of mind. He landed in Rio and uh, he was given the notice on the 13th. The IOA and uh, the, the Indian administrators um, took two days to reply to that notice and it's only uh, a few hours before his bout, before he's actually going to take the mat that he was handed this four years uh, suspended uh, suspension so for nursing it's a uh, uh, it's very difficult to recover now however the biggest loss in this entire episode is India's we could have sent nursing we could have sent Sushil Kumar or a third wrestler now in the 74 kg category India is not represented at Rio and obviously it's a, it's a big embarrassment not just uh, for nursing Yadav but also for India thanks so much Shobit for getting us developments in that story well, shifting focus to something more